Happy anniversary, little one. Well, this is a celebration. You've been with us for a year. Not only that, but you've taken to your new life quite well. I thought a little party might be in order, so feel free to enjoy. There's fresh blood, and I gathered as many of your friends as I could. Yes, I'll join in a moment. I just need to rest. Hmm? <laughs> I assure you, I'm just fine. I just had a big hunt last night, and I'm feeling quite drained. Yes, a glass of be positive would be lovely. <clears throat> Thank you. Can I help you with something? You don't normally socialize with me. You normally are with Samson or Hallie. I suppose I am a bit off today, aren't I? It's like I said, I had a big hunt last night, and I'm not back to myself yet. I'll be fine by tomorrow, I assure you. Now go, enjoy your party. You wish to stay? <laughs> Fine. Have a seat. <laughs> my, my, aren't we full of questions this evening? If you must know, I was hunting a pack of werewolves. No need to panic, little one. I promise you, I'm okay. They were impeding on our territory, something which we swore we would never do. However... Their new leader seems to think she can do whatever she wishes. I had to hunt down the pack she sent after me. Remember what I told you when you first turned? Vampires can easily take a full pack of werewolves on their own so long as it's not a full moon. And it wasn't. It also helps that I'm the alpha here. I'm okay. Yeah, the wolves have a new leader. Their last one was killed by another group of rogue vampires. Her beta is the new alpha. What's a beta? Did I not explain how ranks work here? Oh, I see. Well, it's quite simple. There are four ranks. Alpha, beta, delta, and echo. There is only one alpha, and it's always a female. Well... Almost always. Male alphas have to be created, and they take time to create, and they rarely last long. I know of one male alpha who survived his creation, and is very powerful. I'll tell you about him another time. Anyways, alphas are in charge of their families or packs. Betas are second in command to the alphas. Their sole purpose is to protect their alpha from harm. Sometimes, though, the thirst for alpha is so strong, betas will turn against their alpha. If they succeed in killing them, and not getting caught, they become the new alpha. A delta's job is to watch over the newborns of the family or pack. They train them when the alpha is done introducing them to the world they're now a part of. And lastly, we have the echoes. An echo is exactly what you are, a new part of the family, and their purpose is to train and learn. Actually, part of your celebration tonight is you advancing to Delta. You've grown so much since last year. I'm amazed. I've never seen a newborn so... determined. Even Gavin, our oldest Delta, didn't receive that rank in a year. You are quite the anomaly. Yes, I mean it. You are a rarity. I'll be honest, if this keeps up, you might be alpha one day. If you keep up your strength and don't get into too much trouble, that is. <sighs> oh, it's nothing. I'm sore. Yes, I promise. I'll be okay, little one. There's no need to fret. Though... Since you seem to be in such a helpful mood, why not you help me to my room? I feel a bit unsteady. 
Thank you. Thank you. I just need to lay down. I see you aren't buying me being tired from hunting anymore. It's none of your concern. Yes, you are a part of this family, too. Little one... No, I guess you aren't that little anymore. All right. You can't tell anyone else. The only other person who is aware of this is our Beta. Understand? I'm telling you this because of how outstanding you are. I need to hear you say you understand. Thank you. The hunt. Something went wrong. Their alpha has something I never knew was possible. A hybrid. A werewolf-vampire purebred. Meaning a pure werewolf and a pure vampire had a child. Children born of a vampire and a werewolf never last long, but this one... This one was full-grown. and He was a grown man. He was fast and strong. Yes, I'm fast and strong too, but he was faster. The pack had me surrounded and I took out almost all of them. I had their leader pinned down and I was ready to negotiate our terms set by her previous leader. And then she called out. Cyrus. A full-grown werewolf with vampire fangs seemed to appear from nowhere. His eyes were gold and menacing. I thought he was just another grunt that fell behind until he bore his fangs. I managed to avoid getting bit in the neck, but that didn't stop him from biting my arm. Look. See those black veins? It's poison. Apparently, a hybrid like that has some kind of venom that's toxic to us. Yes... A werewolf scratch is harmful too, but this is like nothing I've ever seen. For the first time in centuries, I feel... pain. I'd be lying if I said a part of me... There's a part of me that didn't enjoy it. But a bigger part of me hates it. No. I don't know how I'm going to fix it. In the meantime... I will pretend that I'm okay. Unless you have a better idea, that's what I'm doing. We can't tell them. Word travels fast, and if the information that I'm hurt gets into the wrong hands, who knows what'll happen? For now, you keep telling them I'm okay. Learn your duties as Delta, and keep your mouth shut, understand? Good. Now, go back to your party. If anyone asks, I'm tired from the hunt, and I'll be back tomorrow. One more thing. You know my beta. Cameron, right? Send her to me, with a glass of O. Please. Thank you, little one. <laughs> 